Yeah, yeah, let's get into it, man. This oink oink, known as Doug Ford, did another quote unquote lockdown slash restriction slash new BS rules. You know what I'm saying? Concerning this panoramic. Okay? I'm not going to get too deep into it. I'm not even going to make this a long video because at the end of the day, we have an idiot in office with an idiot cabinet. Why am I saying an idiot cabinet? Because it's not just him who decides these things, bro. If you understand how people like this go, is that Doug Ford is a figurehead, bro. Doug Ford is nothing more than a mascot, bro. This dude is nothing more than a little mascot or a puppet, bro. He's not the guy who's in charge, bro. It's these medical experts, quote unquote experts, quote unquote uh, leading researchers. It's these CDCs. It's these multinational medical corporations or organizations, whatever they are. Who are making these decisions for us. One second, lockdowns are good. They're important. The next second, they're terrible. Rise in domestic violence. Rise in mental health crises. Rise in depression. Rise in everything that's bad. Suicide attempts. But apparently these are good. Apparently destroying an economy for a whole whole, uh, province. I was going to say country. But basically, it is the country because the country is getting destroyed. It's good. Apparently, Toronto has the longest lockdown in North America. The city with the longest lockdown. Not Los Angeles. Not Texas. No, not Dallas. No, not even New York. Which had been hit with the most by this, uh, you know, panoramic or panini. No, 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 no. Toronto, Ontario, Canada. I hate this. And I know y'all hate it too. And I love seeing the protests. I love Montreal people coming out. I love, I don't like them looting and destroying businesses, which is a little too much. But I understand the frustration. Shouts out to them. Shouts out to my MTL people. You know what I'm saying? Shouts out to y'all. Keep protesting. Keep going against these stupid, stupid rules, man. Because trust me, if we just let them impose and impose and press up on us, how is anything going to change, man? Let's keep on fighting. Let's keep on protesting. Let's stop these stupid measures and these stupid leaders from making stupid rules. Big Baby JTV, we out.